Hey everyone, it's Festive Friday. I have three amazing questions. I'm taking you to Naples, Florida, where I just went on some amazing store visits, but I wanted to stop and answer three great questions, so let's jump right in. First question comes from Mary. She says, Nick, I have curly hair and I usually blow it out straight. My work hours have changed and I don't have the time to blow it out. I want to wear a curly, but it never looks good. Any suggestions? So Mary, I love to wear curly hair. Um, really soft and flowy, not crunchy. So um, put a little leave-in conditioner into your hair when it's wet, and then add in a curling lotion. One that I love right now is the Total Results Curl Please. It's a really great lotion. It's gonna keep your curls defined, but not the crunch. Try it. This question comes from Francesca. She says, I'm noticing a lot of my clients have keratin buildup on their hair. When do you recommend people using keratin products and how long should they use it for? This is a really great question and keratin products are really intended for really damaged hair. So if somebody has really healthy hair and they feel they need a keratin product, they might not need it and they're getting keratin buildup. So make sure to guide them to the right product that's going to be perfect for their hair type. So for instance, if they're lacking moisture, get them on a moisture shampoo. If they have color treated shampoo, shampoo but their hair is really healthy make sure that you're recommending the proper color treated shampoo sometimes somebody just needs your guidance on what the right product is for their hair all right this question comes from Jennifer she says Nick help I just foiled a client the other day and I got bleed marks in the crown area what should I do to fix it so this happens right mistakes happen from time to time how do we fix it you would think the right thing to do would go back into the bleed marks and add the low light, but what you're actually doing by doing that is you're adding a third tone in there. What I like to do is really pull out the highlights in foils, separate them with conditioner, and anything left out that still has blonde in it from the bleed marks, go back into the crown area and apply that deeper formula. It'll have even consistency all the way through the crown and it'll get rid of the bleed marks. All right, everyone, that does it for this Friday. Have an amazing weekend. I will see you next Friday. Remember to submit your questions all week long to win one of my favorite Matrix products. Next Friday, I'll take you to Key West where we will be doing the summer shoot for Ulta Beauty campaign. Can't wait to share it with everybody. Have a great weekend.